Recording. There we go. Also, I need to resume on putting, on posting, uh, YouTube videos. I kind of stopped. But I need to get back on that. How much am I weighing? Oh, so close. Maybe now that it's smelted one, I could put another one. One more. I know we good. I just can't pick up the... There we go. Back, put the back. Oh, I can oh, probably put the rocks back too. That would probably help with not making me encumbered. Man, this game is gorgeous. I can build a new piece of the workshop? Is that what that said? That is what I've been looking for. Okay, so... Need stone, coal, wood, and a workbench. Okay, so that is definitely something I need to build nearby. I don't understand what this little icon is. Can- can't be teleported. Oh. Okay. Okay. Makes sense. Does it make sense, though? <laughs> Might not make any sense. I'm gonna go back and keep mining. my rant will be lost to time because I wasn't recording. Oh, no one but you guys will know what was spoken of here. It was a secret conversation that no one, no one will ever know about. Interesting. So, baddies come when I'm chopping trees, but they don't come when I'm chopping minerals. Or mining minerals. Which is quite interesting. All these things I'm wearing. This is a bad angle, because I, I can get up to like... Yeah, there we go. I can get up to 10. Per hit. I was getting four. There we go. Stone. Hope I'm getting upper too. Oh, I guess the lower it goes. There we go. And my strength is improving. But yeah. Like. By the way, if you guys are lurking, please keep lurking. I'm only asking this if someone feels like a non-lurk, but... i like to hear your thoughts on the games I play today. Loop Hero, I mean Outer Wilds, I think we've... Definitely know where we stand on that one. But... I don't know, have you guys played any of these games before? I know that Loop Hero probably not because it's such a new game, but... Yeah, I feel like I'm going to be playing that game a lot. Addictive games, man. 
addictive games are just... Ooh. I think after I get the copper here, it's pretty much going to be it for tonight. I knew that t today was going to be a bit, little bit of a... Ooh, I'm, I'm getting prime damage on this one. It keeps going underground. You miss Loop Hero? Have you have you ever played um Have you ever played I blanked. I'm blanking. Have you ever played Slay the Spire? Or seen it? If you have, it's nothing like that, except you build a deck. <laughs> um, well, you don't even do that. So I guess it has deck building like Hearthstone, but the deck building is for stuff you're gonna find on your way. Essentially, it's this little, it's one map, top down, 8-bit, very simple, and it's a loop. It's literally a loop. You just see your guy going around, going around, going around, and you add the obstacles that pop up in his way. And you want obstacles because you want to beat the bad guy, essentially. There are reasons, you know, they're in- oh, whoa, they're in-story reasons, but... Wait, we had a coal? Okay, coal burns really fast. Uh, but essentially, every time you go through a loop and you're able to escape, uh, you... You become more, like... You escape and you take the materials you have from your from your escape and you take them and invest them in your camp. And you the camp allows you to become stronger and like with any roguelike, uh, when you become stronger, you are able to go further in the game. So essentially that's the game. It's like very quick loops, um, but every time you play, you become a little bit stronger, a little bit stronger, which allows you to go a little bit further. So, just like Hades or any other roguelike, that's kind of like the concept of it. It's just about becoming stronger and stronger so that you can get to a farther, get farther in the game. Yeah, coal seems to go. Coal, coal goes fast! Okay, I need to put more wood in the, the kiln. But it's oddly addicting. It's it's good. <laughs> Addictions are bad, but it's good. <laughs> it's good. It makes you feel like, mm, you know? Have you ever felt like, mm? That's what it makes you feel. Rods describes things. There we go. Bam. Thirteen. It uses a few per per bar. Like it's a lot of wood. No wonder we destroyed the planet. <laughs> We want to make one bar of metal. Look at how much resource, how much tree we need. Using a game for real life stuff. <laughs> That's frauds. Uh, okay.
I'm here to eat wood and chew bubble gum, and I'm all out of wood. Eight. <laughs> Chop down all those trees. I mean, we're in the process. We're definitely in the process. So I need, I need stone. I need stone. Uh, I need stone. I also need. What do I need? Six. Coal. I need coal. I need coal per. Oh, I, I got, I got the switch. Um, definitely don't need that many. Okay, put that, put those together, put them back. Yeah, now that these things are getting really heavy, it's kind of becoming hard to. Okay, what else do I need? Or coal. That should be easy. And do I have six? So I can put two in. Go. So now I'm gonna put this here. Need to be close? Okay, might not need to be close. I'm gonna put it. Yeah. I don't know which side I need either. I think this might be the right side. That's where it seems to have the tools. Just gonna put it right there. Oh, I can put a sconce? Oh, I can make a sconce. Here. Can make a copper knife. Wait, how do I make a sconce? I want to make a sconce. <laughs> I want to make a sconce. Um, how much damage do I do? Okay, I don't. Yeah, yeah. Kind of sucks. It's kind of sucky forge. <laughs> Why did I learn how to make a sconce from that? It doesn't make any sense. Did I learn how to make anything new here? Flint knife. Makes you more sneaky. Armor level 6. Helmet. Armor level 2. Ooh, I need 5 troll hides though. Oof. Wait, where? How? How, how do we make a sconce? <laughs> how do we make a sconce? Oh, it's here. Okay. What do I need for a sconce? Oh, I need two resin. Two copper, two wood, two resin. Eh, eh, I don't need it right now. Don't need to do that. Okay. Oh, am I out of... Did I run out of coal? I mean... Yeah, I ran, ran out of, uh, whatever it's called, copper, copper ore. Interesting. Definitely something I didn't think I was going to run out of. At least not this soon. I know, I know. Oh, so close. Yes. Yeah, this will essentially be what I do today. Just to finish up the stream. <laughs> Let the brain rest a little bit after the... What do you mean I don't have any coal? What? I see. How many woods do we have? Okay. I'm gonna come bring more wood. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. 
Hope you had fun watching me stream. I'll be honest, I definitely had fun. Jump over the fire. That's not jumping over the fire. <laughs> You win some, you lose some. <laughs> sometimes you put your foot in the fire. Sometimes you, you, you don't, I guess. Fire bad. <laughs> yep. Fire is bad. Joe Smith's son is learning. <laughs> He is learning. He's going from Uga Uga times to a little bit smarter than Uga Uga times. At least I have a good amount of copper ore now, but not ore, copper. What are these called? Oh. Bar, copper bar. But can't build anything with it. I can build a little dinky knife. I don't want to build a dinky knife. Like why can't can I build a cool copper sword? This is nine. Three to five. My weapon. My weapon is 18. Unless this is 18. That's one thing I don't know, and I will look this up. Can I open my thing, please? Okay, I guess I can't open my thing. And I will look this up. Do not. Wow, I'm in on all caps. Do. Well, how am I still in all caps? Do all do knives do s both slash and pierce damage Valheim? Ooh, okay, half slash half pierce. So actually, it's just as good as my weapon. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute, it's just as good as my... Oh... Six damage. Oh... Okay, okay... So I do need, so it does do <laughs> yelling at Google. Hey man, hey, sometimes you gotta speak a little louder to Google for it to understand. That's what I've learned from my grandpa. <laughs> Poor guy, he's a good man, he just doesn't know. Although computers are starting to talk back, so. I guess his fears are becoming true. By the way, that's all jokes. I never got to meet any of my grandpa paws. A lot of my grandmas are grandpas. Oh wow. That actually went pretty quick. I'm grandpa-less. I'm paw-less. So, from what I'm gathering, I need it is like forging a level. 
said that really weird. No. Because, like, I don't understand why it's not showing me other things. Like... Why am I not seeing... Yeah, why... I don't know. <laughs> okay. Tanning rack. Do I have to do other upgrades? So confusing. <laughs> Maybe it's because my brain got fried after playing so much Outer Wilds. I'm just like, uh. Mm. Oh, there we go. All right. But it seems like making a, a knife might be a good idea. So two wood and eight copper. I didn't have to put everything away. Two wood and eight copper. Alright. I want eight, please. Thank you. Two wood now. Two wood. Is this might be my new go to here? If I want to upgrade, I need. Oh, I can do that. And then it's 10, 10. I do 20 damage with a, with a dinky knife. That's more damage than I've ever done before. I need to use finally use this thing <laughs> that I've never had any use for before. Do I have enough copper? I just need to bring out some copper. Oh, I'm not even encumbered, so. I can just come here. How do I upgrade the forge? How do I upgrade a forge? How do I improve a forge? Bench improvement. Okay. Rod slowly descends into madness. Well, it's still... I mean, it's still as much damage as... As I was doing before. Parry force 10, parry bonus 4, knock back 10, knock back 25, it's fine. Backstrap 3 times, movement speed negative 5. Yeah, the 10 times backstab. Yeah, this is just kind of a better weapon. Uh, it has better. How heavy is it? Wait, 2? Wait, point three. I might actually remove the hoe from... from circulation for now. And just have two weapons. Like that. Because the weight of the knife is so small that... It doesn't really matter. What was this again? Red Dwarf Eye. Okay. Doesn't really mean anything to me. Also, you can teleport. Which would be very convenient to know. Yes, technology! 
gonna cut a couple trees for fun. Because that's what we like to do. Kill the environment. There we go. Stump out of the way. I like how the stump just juts out once you... <laughs> Timber! Ooh! Double tree. I wonder what other kinds of things I can put into the smelter. See, this is what I'm talking about. Every time I start chopping, baddies show up. But it doesn't happen when I'm... Ooh, I get to try my new weapon. Ooh! Look at that! Hey now. Hey now, hey now. Don't dream it's over. Birch, too hard. For you, maybe. Is it gonna hit any trees? Ah, unfortunate. In two minutes, I have killed three trees. I guess not even that. Have I been doing that for two minutes? I hear a baddie. Or do I? If a tree falls in the woods and no one's there to see it, did it truly fall? If a baddie comes from up behind you, but there was no baddie after all, are you insane? All the real questions in life may not be real at all. Are we safe? I'm making a poem. Oh, such a poem. I never, I understand poems, but I never got the point of poems. I feel poems are kind of dumb. And I understand, I think poems, one very good way poems can be had and just be good. <laughs> it's called music. When you put music t to the poem, it's just a song. I like songs. I think the rhythm of the words and everything kind of has a payoff once you add music to it. But when it's just a poem and it's just like, a dude, aka me, talking about stuff, being like, oh my heart. How it how it flutters by the thought of playing this game. No human, no person will ever achieve as much emotion in me as this digital entity. I am therefore never going to marry anyone but this computer. Like, you know, that's kind of boring, that's kind of stupid, but it's poetry. But now you add some music to it, and it's like, yeah, boy, you get that computer. And then everyone's, everyone's just like, you know, kind of bothered, kind of like, oh, that was kind of nice. So. That's what I'm saying. You add music to it. Bam, it's a whole different thing. Okay, I'm going to jump over the fire. Does it- can I not run and jump? Okay, I cannot sp <laughs> Sorry, I just saw the image of a man running out of his house on fire. <laughs> um... Okay. Where was the tree I was cutting? Oh, here it goes.
but see to today's Valheim stream but brought to you by ranting rods you want to hear him rant just stay to the end of the stream when he's tired and he's just saying nonsense <laughs> It's the closest we'll, we're getting to a, a test stream of ye olden days. Those were crazy. There's always something weird happening in those. Never forget. <laughs> Never forget the test streams. Oh, we're really making a clearing around the village. Is that poo poo? Really bothers me. Oh, it's just seeds. Aren't seeds like poop? No, they're very different from poop rods. <laughs> seeds have nothing to do with poop. I feel like that's the type of comment, and to get super meta here on streaming, I feel like that's the type of comment that a lot of streamers make, and that's like, then you know, they get a bunch of comments, and it's like, oh, ha, ha. so like, I always wonder if we're making dumb comments like that on purpose, or, or not, because I feel like a lot of the successful streamers, not all of them, and not a majority of them, but like, a lot of successful streamers put on this like, I'm kind of dumb facade to it. <laughs> because they say these ridiculous things, they're like, yeah, of course, like, they play it as if they're serious about it, but I have a feeling they're not. I don't know. Okay. Oh, yeah! <gasps> I did- Because, <sighs> like, you- Part of the co the comedy of so many of the biggest streamers is just, like, they say something dumb, and they, like, stand by what they said. But it's like one of the dumbest things things you've ever heard. So I really do wonder like how much of that is. Real versus how much of it is just a put on show. Let's get philosophical here. How real are people? <laughs> All right, this will be my last tree. Ooh, uh, makes it hard for it to be the last tree. Ooh, it just flew away. And another tree has fallen. Oh wow, there's a lot of wood here. And not, not as many bad guys popping up. I'm surprised. Also, I am loving the games that are made in Unity getting some good rep now. I, I've been seeing other games that look gorgeous. Oh, okay, game. Now that I said I'm going away once I finish cutting the chopped trees, you keep chopping trees for me. Thanks. I'm seeing a lot of good games, like graphically gorgeous games that are coming out of Unity. And I feel like Unity had such a bad rep for such a long time. But I'm happy, I'm happy, because I, I do like Unity. Oh, here we go, Here, here's a bad guy. Hello. I I really enjoy Unity. That's kind of like, I'm, that's what I'm doing stuff in. Thick boy now. This is gonna be my last run into the house and back out. This is... So it doesn't seem to use any resources too in this game to fix stuff, which is interesting. I mean, I won't complain, but oh man, I'm out of space. Well, I guess I can't get burned when there's no fire in the thing. Wow, this is becoming a very big clearing. Hmm. 
Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. There we go. That's all I'm doing to- wait, did I get the stump? I think I got the stump. Yeah. So that's what's I'm, what I'm gonna be doing tonight. I'm just gonna put stuff- I see you! I'm gonna fight this guy, because he's looking at me weird. Ooh! Ooh! That's some power. I like this knife. Bye, beautiful game. Yeah, this knife is great. I love it. Alright. Well, thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you had a good time watching the stream today. Sorry for the scuffedness <laughs> of today's stream. It was a little bit... It was a little bit rough. Hope that's all right. There we go. But I hope I hope you guys had fun, and I hope to see you all again on Monday. And I hope everyone has a fantastic weekend. It's restful, so I'm gonna have to move my. Why am I gonna move my resin? What's a good resin spot? Sure, I'll put the resin here. Okay. All right. There we go. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Let's go back to the menu because it's a beautiful song. Thank you for watching. Hope you have a great weekend. And I will see you all on Monday and on the Discord. Until then. But yeah, hope you have a good night. Rest well. Enjoy your weekend. And I will see you then. <laughs>